guys, um, I haven't done a video in a while, and uh, this video might be quite useful to you, because I know what this video is, basically, by the title, you're wondering how can I get an iOS 7 game that I've never had onto my iOS 6 device. Which, it's quite simple, but you do need a PC or a Mac with a iTunes, and it might need to be synced with your device. I don't know. Well, basically, so what you do, go on iTunes, and it's like the app. The Apple Store, it 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 doesn't let you download iOS seven games unless, of course, you've had them before when you could have them on iOS six devices. So basically, this only works with games that came out on iOS six or below. So, so it probably won't work on newer applications. So what you want to do is go on iTunes, click iTunes Store, and then you wanna search whatever application you wanna get. So then say Typic. You need iOS seven for this. Uh, type it, yeah. yeah. You need iOS 7 for typing, and uh, it's, it says I've downloaded it, but I don't have iOS 7 on my iPod. So, what you want to do is click download, and uh, when you click download, you'll download it on this. And then it will like send it to your device that running iOS six or below. Um, so like, alright. So I wanna click this, and um, I'll do my password. And okay, guys, and you can see it's now downloading. I think. I don't know if this needs iOS 7, but if it does, then, uh, well, if it does need iOS 7, what you want to do is, you uh, download the app, then when it's, uh, when it's downloading on your iPod or whatever, then you want to, uh, delete it, so... Hold this. Delete it. Then you want to go onto the App Store. Type in whatever it was called. Uh, so it was called. Type it. Something like that. So you type it in. Find your app. You go click the download button. And this is no, but so with this, with normal typing, then a uh, why is there so much reflection? Can all right. So with this typing, you are gonna when you download it, it. Well, so basically, go on iTunes, down, go to store, download it, yeah, so once you've done that, it should be downloading on your iPod or whatever, then you want to delete it while it's downloading on your iPod, go onto the App Store, search it up, and click on the iCloud bubble or whatever, 
and it would say this app needs iOS 7 but you can if because if you've had an app before you can downgrade it so that you can use it on iOS 6 so what you want to do is click uh, download the latest version for uh, for your operating system and then it should work on your iPod okay thanks for watching guys and I guess I haven't been making videos because um I've been on holiday right uh, I'll see you in another video make sure to leave a like and maybe subscribe thank you bye